What's up folks, I'm Lil Guillotine and welcome back to the Real Guillotine Hours. In my previous video, we designed a guillotine and made a materials list of all the different pieces of material that we will need to cut, what lengths they need to be, what shapes they need to be in order for us to assemble our little guillotine. So here we go, let's hit it. Uh, this was mostly filmed in my basement. Excuse my basement for being pretty cluttered at this point. This is definitely the first construction video I've ever done. And so, yeah, you'll see it now. If you haven't checked it out, check out the previous video about the design. It was definitely a fun process. Had to apply trigonometry to the design and look up some already existing guillotines to get a reference for the height to width ratio and it was a great time. Of course we may need guillotines as early as November 4th depending on what happens with the election should Trump decide to not step down, should enough of the white supremacist goons who make up a lion's share of Trump's base decide to stage an uprising and a possible civil war, we may need a bunch of these guillotines. So best to get the skills to build them now, you feel me? I honestly am not a carpenter, I am a master plumber. So I don't have a lot of carpenter skills. It's definitely noticeable. If there's any revolutionary carpenters watching, and you see me engaged in my non-carpentry tomfoolery, definitely call it out and give some suggestions in the comments section below so that we can all get our guillotine skills intact and honed, you know what I'm saying?
not too shabby. So that's it, yo. Gonna be throwing this on a stalk around costume to use for Halloween and for performances before and after. Should there ever be live performances again in the world? Because right now really sucks with the pandemic. All the live performances, of course, are on hold for who knows how many more months, right? So there it is. You too can design and build your own Lil Guillotine. So if you thought this was an amusing video, definitely hit that like button. Hit subscribe so you can see more of my content as it comes out. I am working on a video about the guillotine as a symbol for the radical left. Is it a good symbol? Is it too violent? Is it too authoritarian? So keep your eyes peeled for that. And in the meantime, happy guillotining. Whether it's building or it's chopping, there is no stopping. Alright y'all, peace out.